Good morning, friends. So, I'm on my own today. Not for the full day. Craig has actually gone out to collect, you probably know by the title already, but he has gone to collect a van. <laughs> It's crazy, we've wanted a van for so long. We always said that if things didn't work out with this place, with this house, then we were just gonna buy a van and live in a van. But the laws in Ireland are very difficult, so it makes it incredibly difficult to actually live in a van. So we thought the best of both worlds would be to buy a house and buy a van. We decided to buy the van quite cheap. Um, I think we're buying the van for about 2,000 euros. Yeah, so, that's, that's what we've done and we are going to do it up so you might see like a, a van build series um, coming on the channel. I am pointing this way as well because um, in front of me is just a mess and please excuse my skin, I am having a very bad acne day. Um, I really don't want to see any negativity so please just ignore my skin. <laughs> um, so yeah, he's kind of left me on my own. What I'm going to do is... I'm gonna make some lunch because I said good morning, it is actually quarter to one in the afternoon. So I'm gonna make some lunch, we made some hummus this morning, and yeah, so lunch, and then I'm gonna paint, um, I'm gonna paint a kind of a painting <laughs> from my mum as like a gift, so um, yeah, I might film that. Um, I can show you my sandwich. <laughs> No, how do these? How do people vlog? Um, so yeah, I, I can show you my sandwich. I guess I don't know. If not, then the next thing you see is going to be Craig rolling up with the van. So you'll be just as surprised as I will be on what you see next. Okay, so Craig is on his way home and I have to finish this painting. I have paint in my hair. This is all going wrong. So, it's happening. <laughs> uh, Craig is in a town that is maybe 10 minutes away, 10 minutes away. Um, so he told me to get ready and that he's coming with our new van. So, I don't know if I said this at the start, but I haven't seen this van. Um, the guy who was selling it was, he was very, um, what's the right word? Not sketchy, but very adamant on the times that he wanted um, people to come view it. Um, so the only way that we could actually go see it was um, while I was working and obviously I couldn't do that. So Craig went to go see it during the week he said it's all good, um, so yeah, he's picking it up today. And 
I have no idea what it looks like, how big it is. Like Craig said, it's big enough. I'm not too sure. We will see. So yeah, he should be here in like five or 10 minutes. <laughs> Look at him, he's so cute. Please excuse all of the mess on the coffee table. Hey bud. I'm sorry, did I wake you? I'm sorry, did I wake you? You ready to see your new adventure van? Because you're coming with us, aren't you? Oh, chin scratches, chin scratches. Guess who just showed up? So we are going to see the van. And if you are wondering why I'm wearing checkered shirt and leopard print leggings, don't judge me. Raining. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> oh my God, it's so cold. This is the new van. The van. I don't know why, but I really expected the sliding door to be this side. I think you'd have thought so, wouldn't you? Yeah. I guess it's on the safe side, really. I suppose, yeah. Show us the back. We're van people now. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Hurry up, it's raining. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I think that did it. <laughs> Walking takes some getting used to. Wow! This is what we got. This is what we're working with. Can you open this? <laughs> <laughs> I cannot. Okay, so that doesn't work. That doesn't work. No, that, nope. doesn't, that doesn't work right now. All right, okay, so that's on the list to fix. Yeah, that's on the list of things to fix. Wow, so what do we have here? We have a 2003 Ford Transit long wheelbase, medium height roof. Medium height. Medium height. Medium height. Yeah. Stand up. <laughs> this is it, this is what you got. Stand up straight. <laughs> Let's go around and see the sliding door because that's my favorite bit. Watch your head, watch your head, watch your head. I know. Well. Yep. Yeah. Here we so, are. I mean, it's not, it's not the tallest. Although, I feel like this floor is like. A false floor? A false floor, maybe. So we might be able to out. <laughs> we might be able to get some more out of it, but I don't know. We'll have to look into that. Okay. Oh my God. That tinting was done so badly. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah. <laughs> High quality. Right. Oh. So. So we're going to be taking this, yeah, this bulkhead, bulkhead is coming out. And then that will open that up. And then we can sort of, the bed's going to be here, isn't it? We said. Yeah. And then the rest of the living area is going to be where you are. Yeah. So. So we're thinking about a pop top. Yeah, we're thinking about it. We'll have to see. Yeah. Because they are rather pricey. They are more than what we paid for this entire van. <laughs> so, maybe have a van build series coming? Maybe, I hope so. Yeah. <laughs> we this van for nothing. <laughs> but no, I think it'll be okay. Once it's, once it's done out and stuff, I think it'll be fine. It'll be fine. <laughs> Very amateur van builders. Yeah. Oh my, there's rust here. That's okay, it's inside. <laughs> You're bound to get a little bit of rust. Yeah. It's the, 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 the main... <laughs> yeah. So that's okay. Yeah. Those windows are coming out. Those are tinted. No, just, just the windows. windows <laughs> the windows in general. So new doors then, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well you've broken one of them, so. I haven't broken it. Well it's a little bit broken. Yay, we're van owners! So we're van people now. Yeah. Will we take them around the front? You sure. 
I really wish there was like smell of vision. It stinks. Yeah, in here. the previous owner was a bit of a smoker. Um some light stainage. Yeah, look, right. Definitely. Very light stainage. Definitely. So all this needs to be ripped out and basically started again. <laughs> but no, I think it'll be okay. It just needs a good a good tidy up and a good renovation. The thing is, is right, it's a mechanically sound van. It's as mechanically sound as you're going to get for a 18-year-old van. And for 2,000 euros. For 2,500 euros. So, you know what? It's not the worst. So, uh, do you want to pop the bonnet? Maybe people are interested in that. I actually can't without a big screwdriver because there's a lock on the front of these bonnets and I, I need to go get a big screwdriver to open it. Right. So, I mean, I can go get the screwdriver if you want. Yes, let's go get the screwdriver. I'll be back. Okay. You're you supposed to take the grill off? No. He's had to he said he had to drill it out. He broke my One eternity later. Say! Plans. There are a few little bits that need fixing. Uh, the back door needs fixing. The back door needs saw. fixing. Because someone broke it. Someone broke it. And we need to figure out what's going on with the bonnet. Yeah, it's popping open, but I can't. The, there's like usually like a little lever or a button or something that just needs to take it all the way, and I cannot find that. And it's very cold right now, so, so but we are inside for the heating. Now that I've seen it, I think plans are going to change a little bit. Yeah. Because we were originally we kind of thought of having a partition between the back and the front mm. with a door. Instead of the bulkhead, so you can get back to front easy. But with that shelf at the top, mm. it's pretty redundant. Yeah. And then we're planning to have a, a full width bed. Mm -hmm. um, but I'm 5'10 and you're 6 foot. Mm -hmm. So we are not short people at no. all. We'll see how that will gonna go. The laws in Ireland about camper vans, they're quite strict. Mm -hmm. And expensive. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so you have, what is it? You have to have a bed. You have to have a bed. You need a, what was it, a sink? You need a, you need a bed, a sink, a fixed cooking system. Yeah. So a little like portable propane stove isn't gonna do it. No, it has to be something fixed. It has to be fixed. And then I think the rest <clears> of it's <throat> very vague, like it has to be sort of, it's, yeah. it's very vaguely written. Like you have to be able to walk in it standing up, but a person of average height and yeah. what do they class as average height? We yeah, don't know. But it's it's going to be a little bit of to and fro with them, I think. We have no idea what we're doing. No. <laughs> we have seen other people do it, so how hard can it be? That is our plan. How well it's going to go, I don't know. We will see. The van was quite cheap, so... If we fuck up, it's not that bad. It's not like we've spent <laughs> 50,000 euros no, on a sprinter no, it's, or it's, something. It's, 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 it's quite cheap. It's a 2,000 euro, 2,003 Ford Transit. Yeah, so <laughs> it doesn't matter if it all goes wrong. Well, it does. It yeah, does I, ideally, I would like it not to go wrong. I, we've said that one of our goals is to drive it to Russia. Yeah, so we'll see how that goes. We will see how that goes. I don't know how well it's going to turn out. No, me either. But if you're watching this maybe a year or two down the line, <laughs> then you'll know how it pans out. So yeah, if you want to see more of that, then hit the subscribe button. Ding. And the notification bell. Oh, that's the one that goes ding. That's the one that goes ding. And you can follow us on Instagram. Um, the handle is there and it was at the start of the video as well. Stay tuned for more van related content. Yeah, so that's that. We will see you in the next one. Peace. Bye.